No fluff today, only sound design. This is the bass that we're gonna be making. The preset looks like this, and I actually made it in Serum 1, but you can, it can be used in Serum 2. And you can also get this preset by going to the free tier of my Patreon. It's completely free, you just you click the link, you go to the Patreon, and it's up there. But this base is actually really simple. All it basically is, like the main principle of it, is just having a saw wave being FM'd by something a little spectral monstery and then using a bin plus on the wavetable. And you can get a bunch of different variations of the sound. Without the uh, alien spectral, it just sounds like this. Which is still like pretty fat, but the alien spectral really gives it the, the meh. The monsterness of it. So yeah, let's just initialize the preset and I'm gonna do my best on oscillator B, go to default shapes and go to spectral, alien spectral. You can also do some of the other spectral wavetables. This is just what I found worked really good for me. Go to the warp mode and bin plus. You can also try mirror and other types of warp modes. And then I uh, turn the random phase all the way to zero for both of these. And then turn your level down for the alien spectral. And then you want to FM from B. But with Serum 2, it's actually phase distortion. It's not true FM. So we're going to phase distort it from B. And I found that like around here seemed to work the best for me. This is what we got so far. And you can see how like the wavetable position is really gonna affect how the sound sounds. And also doing the bend is gonna change it a lot. But that's already like pretty nasty. So I'm just gonna assign LFO one to the level of oscillator A, just to give us our webbiness. And then we're gonna turn on our noise oscillator. And we're gonna go to analog and use bright white. And then we're also gonna use LFO1 on the level of the noise. And I like to keep it not too crazy because at a certain point, it just, it just gets too much. And then we need to route this to the filter and the noise. Route those all to this filter and modulate the cutoff with that same LFO. And you can choose between the MG Low to MG24. Uh, I like the 12 for this one just because it, uh, it sounds a little looser. And in the past, I was having trouble trying to make a sound like this because I was going too crazy with the distortion. So um, I'm just going to leave it on tube and bring the distortion up a bit. But you, you really don't have to distort the shit out of everything. See, it starts sounding like that. Next, we need a static phaser, which if you don't know what that is, it's pretty much we turn everything down and uh, you leave the mix up. And that's another way you can get a lot of different tonalities. So that frequency knob is really gonna determine how alien-like your bass sounds. And you can even automate it with the LFO if you so choose to. And now let's put on a multiband compressor, because we have to. I notice in a lot of the YDG basses, like, he's he's got the highs in there a lot. So I'm gonna kind of push these highs just a little bit. And after that, we're pretty much done. Another interesting thing I did to push the highs even more was I put this LFO on the gain of a high shell filter, either a little bit below or right at the center. And then just play around with it. I, I try to do mostly the like high mids and highs. So it's like this. Oops, not that much. Oh, and I think this needs to go before the compressor. And I noticed a little bit of a high pass, like just a little bit, not cutting off everything, actually cleans it up and sounds kind of nice. And you can also automate that. You could even do it like that if you want to do a sub separately and just like completely cut out the lows. But in the song that I used this for, I actually had this as the sub and the main bass. And then finally, we just need a filter after all of that to keep our webbiness going just so it's mirroring the filter in here if you want to get this preset you can get it for free by clicking the link in the description and if you want to pay me five dollars you can join the homie tier and get a bunch of other serum presets like this <laughs>